still in Lagos. The government says it's set to nurture diverse cultural heritage of the state at them by fostering arts and championing the growth of its uh, tourism sector. The Commissioner for Tourism, Arts and Culture, Tucker Benson Awika, uh, says stated this uh, during the 2024 ministerial press briefing to mark the first year of Governor Bajasovalu's second term in office on Monday at Alausa Keja. Now, tourism commissioner said that the ministries had, in the last one year, embarked on hosting of cultural activities, tourist attractions, training, among other initiatives, while collaborating with uh, local and international organizations on Lagos Theatre Festival, Talent Hunt, Afro Police, Lagos 2024, to promote tourism. Now, Benson and Winka who restated a commitment to the state's tourism master plan, all stakeholders to partner with the government to build a legacy of cultural excellence that enriches lives, inspires a generation and leaves an indelible mark on the world. When the John Randall Center was commissioned by the former president, it was at the last stage of completion. It has since been completed. It's been handed over to the ministry just on the 28th of March. We're currently in the process of getting an operational team for the place. As we know, we do not also want to mix governance with running the museum. So we're getting an operational team that will run the place. Uh, we have uh, areas that are to be concessioned out. Those are also also being looked at as well so that it will be privately run, despite the fact that it is a public facility so that we can get the best out of that place in usage. She also entered on plans by the Tourism Ministry to engage tourism stakeholders in the hospitality sector on current industry challenges, emerging trends, policy frameworks and uh, collaborative uh, opportunities within the entire hospitality value chain on May the 30th. Well, for all those who would be affected by the construction work to deliberate on strategies for cooperation within government throughout the road construction. We assure the stakeholders of the preservation of tourism assets along the coastal area and also assure them of proactive measures that will be taken by both the federal and the state governments to mitigate the identified bottlenecks in view of the development with the road construction will also bring to the residents. We had other stakeholders' engagements in the hospitality sector. We have concluded plans to meet with um, the hospitality sector to discuss all such initiatives, policies that would affect them, such as what had just recently affected them with the coastal road, and other areas where the ministry would be able to actually drive tourism and as well as make sure that. They Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.